Yeah. Shit'll kill ya. Welcome back to Rated J Games, guys. Jay here as always, and today we're going to be playing Pokemon Omega Ruby for the Nintendo 3DS. I've never played this, even when it was on the Game Boy Advance, I believe it was. So, this is actually all new to me, and I've been wanting to play a Pokemon game for a good long while, so why not start with this one? Let's uh, get through the cutscene here. Oh, that's pretty cool. You might see some stuttering or whatnot. Probably not a lot. I am playing on an emulator at the moment, so... Let's hopefully we can get through the game smoothly without many hiccups. Oh, that is awesome. The Pokemon looks so good. Well then. That sounds great, too. Oh, here we go. Hi, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Perch, but everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. And this is... Well, and this is what we call a Pokemon. Well then. Oh, are we just watching? This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon at times, playing together as friends and at times helping one another out. And sometimes we just like to have fun battling others, like us. But as close as we are, we don't know Ever. Well, it's just going to go really fast, so... Yeah! <laughs> I'm not even going to try to read it anymore, damn it. Uh... Aww. All I know is there will be a Pikachu on my team. That's all I really care about. What about you? Are you a boy or a girl? Will you give me your name, too? I suppose. Uh, um. Oh. And, uh, there we go. Yes, yes I am. Ah, I see. You're that J. Well, what have you been told? You're the one who's moving to Little Root Town. Where I live. Yeah. Are you ready? I hope so. Your very own adventure is now about to unfold. Be courageous and leap into the world of Pokemon, where dreams, adventures, and... Screw off, game! I was trying to read all that. I am just in a truck, can I? Can I keep you? It's a Azrael doll? I'm going to butcher a lot of these Pokemon names. I am just letting you know this now. <clears throat> so, is this our little town? What is that? What are you? I feel like you're about to show me. Or not. Jay, you're here at last. Wasn't it rough riding in the back of the bumpy moving truck all the way? All that way. Wow. Maybe I shouldn't read. Well, this is Little Root Town. What do you think? This is going to be our new home. It has a quaint feel, but it looks like it should be a nice place to live, don't you think? 
And you get your own room this time. Yay! I know it said J, but yay. Come on, you have to see the inside. It's a shack, ma! <laughs> oh god. Alright, maybe it's not that much of a shack. CJ, isn't it nice in here too? The moving company's Pokemon even help with the unpacking and cleanup. They really make moving a cinch since they're slaves. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thanks for all the hard work. We really appreciate it. <laughs> it's going to beat you, ma. Bye. Uh, we get it. Go. Go away. You should go and see your new room upstairs, Jay. Dad even brought a new clock for it to help celebrate the big move. You'll need to set the time, though. Okay. We gotta set time on a clock, apparently. Okay. Let's go up and look at my new clock. The clock on a wall isn't moving. You've got to set the time. Fine. The hour hand was set to 17, and the minute hand to 42. That's about right. How do you like your new room, Jay? Good. Everything's put away neatly. They finished moving everything in downstairs, too. It really is so nice having Pokemon around to help us. Oh, but you should make sure that everything's all there on your desk. Get out of my room, ma! God damn. No privacy. Jay's notebook is full of adventures, rules he jotted down. Adventure rule number one. Open a menu with the X button. Record your progress with save. Oh, ah, eh, already saving. This shouldn't be as bad as uh, Resident Evil. Can I go to bed? Snorlax! Oh, what are you? It's a Wii U! It has a gamepad with a screen! Too bad it sucked! No, it didn't. The Wii U is a good thing. Mom might like this program. You better get going. I'm right, you better get going. Oh, Jay, Jay! Quick, come quickly! What? It's the Petalburg Gym. Maybe Dad will be on TV. Interviewer. We brought you to report live from in front of the Petalburg Gym. Next up, a special look at a long-awaited meteor shower in the next star show. Oh, it's already ended. Looks like your dad was on, but we missed his part. What a shame. How do you know he was on? But that reminds me, one of Dad's friends lives in this town. Professor Birch is his name. He lives next door, so you should go over and introduce yourself. Fine. Go over. You're gonna kick me out anyway. I have to go catch Pokemon and stuff. Jay's house. Woohoo! Professor Birch. You just walk right in, you know? Bitch, get out of my house! I mean, oh, hello. <laughs> Are you the... Who are you? Oh, you're Jay, our new next door neighbor. Welcome. We have a daughter about the same age as you. She has been so excited about making a new friend. She should be in her room upstairs. I hope you'll go introduce her. So you gonna let me up in your daughter's room? What if I'm a rapist? Fine, I'll go up. Damn. Hi, lady. says nothing. Pokemon fully restored, items already, and... Get out of my room! Huh? Who are you? Oh, you must be Jay. 
your move was today, huh? Well, I'm May. Glad to meet you. I I actually have this dream of becoming friends with Pokemon all over the world. And then when Dad, oh, I mean Professor Birch, told me about you moving here, Jay. Well, I was hoping you would be nice and we could be friends. But but that's just silly, isn't it? I've just met you, right, Jay? Uh, yeah. So what am I talking about? <laughs> oh no, I forgot. I was supposed to be going out to help Dad catch some wild Pokemon. Jay, I'll see you later. Alright, cool. I'll just steal all your stuff. I mean, you guys left me up here. Just, I mean, what's on your TV? Dad might make this program better. Okay. Let's see. What did you jot down? There are some notes on the page written in cute brown script. This will be the next test. Each Pokemon can learn up to four moves. Which moves you teach a Pokemon will show how good of a trainer you are. I, when I played Pokemon, I was usually like a brute force type of guy. I didn't really deal with status effects or anything like that. Well, um, did I talk to you? Where's that husband of mine? It was so good of you to visit, Jay. And yet, he's nowhere to be found. Friends are a whole week's worth of meals. Wow. Oh. So... Not... Oh, oh, I can run! Usually I have to go out. I think I hear someone screaming up ahead. Yep, see, I usually have to go out of town. What should I do? What should we do? Somebody has to go help! It should go help! Help me! Oh no. Oh god. Is this how we're gonna pick our Pokemon? Uh, hello! You! Over there! Please help me out! In my bag, there are some Pokeballs! Yeah! Alright, which one are we gonna choose? Uh, I usually go with fire. The grass could be a different change, but... Mudkip... Torchic... Trico. I'm gonna go with Torchic. I like fire Pokemon. Whoa! Whoa, Puginia! Right? Or Puchihina? I don't know! Hmm. Fight! Uh... Let me burn your face off, please. Whoa! The Wild Puchihina... Ah, I feel as if I'm butchering that name. Scratch your face off! And you're down. Woohoo! At least Torchic's name's easy to pronounce, right? Phew! I went into the tall grass to survey wild Pokemon when I was suddenly jumped. You saved my hide. Thanks a lot. Oh! But you're Norman's boy, Jay. I didn't even realize who you were at first. You've grown into the quite the young man. This isn't the place for a chat, though. Come along to my lab. Your house or lab? I didn't see a lab. There it is. Now I see the lab. <laughs> so, Jay. I've heard so much about you from your father. But he said that you don't have your own Pokemon yet. If that's true, that was quite the performance back there. Looks like you really are your father's son. I hope so. Oh, his mom's been messing with the mailman. Oh, yes. To say thanks for rescuing me out there. How about I give you that Pokemon you used earlier? I just got a torch chick. 
While you're at it, why not give a nickname to your Pokemon? How about no? Oh, so that's how you like to do things. Not even going to give it a nickname, are you? No. You know, if you work with your Pokemon and gain experience, I think you'll have a pretty excellent- you'll make a pretty excellent trainer. My girl, May, happens to be out on Route 103 right now surveying Pokemon for me. It might not be a bad idea for you to head out that way yourself. What do you think? Alright. Great. I'm sure May will be happy to hear that too. Yeah. Wow. Wow, I can't speak worth a damn today. She can help teach you what it means to be a trainer. Oh, yes. And if you're ever lost along the way, use the area nav on your PokéNav Plus. You can use it to see how to get to Route 103, where May ought to be. And if you and your Pokémon get tired, get some rest back at your new house. I don't think I'm tired, but uh, let's let's go find May. At Route 103. Oh, you actually move around the bottom of the screen. That's cool. This is Route 101. Can't get over there. So where is Route 103? 102, 103. Okay. 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 So we gotta go this way. And get to our first pokey battle. With a bug. It's a bug. It's a gross bug. Most bug Pokemon are gross. Burn it alive, please. Thank you. Yay. It, it needed to die. I needed to kill it with fire. Just bugs are gross. Sorry to say, but they are. Odal Town or whatever. Hi there. I work at the Pokemart. From what I could see, you're a novice trainer. Am I right? Okay. Being super kind-hearted as I am, I'm going to give you useful advice. First of all, that's a Pokemark there. Just look uh, for our blue roof. We sell a variety of goods, including Pokeballs for catching Pokemon. I'd like you to have these as part of a special promotion. Just give me free stuff, cool. Potions can be used anytime, so they can be very useful to have. And this is a Pokemon Center. Look for the red roof. Ask a woman inside and she'll restore your Pokemon's health. Yeah, I get it, sir. That's it. That was the advice from me, the supremely kind-hearted clerk. Have a great journey. Everybody? Didn't it, like, torture just to kick your kid out at, like, what, 10? To make him go fight wild animals? Yeah, yeah. I, I don't think he took much damage, but there you go. Boop, 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 boop. Why would you want to see me again? I mean, isn't that kind of rude? Are you hoping my Pokemon get hurt? You evil bitch. Okay, we gotta go, what, this way? To May, who I think is right here. What you looking at, girl? Let's see, on Route 103, I found this Pokemon. And this one, and this one too. Oh, hey, Jay! What's that? Oh, my dad gave you a Pokemon as a gift, huh? 
Well then, why don't we go ahead and have a quick battle? Why? I'll give you a taste of what being a trainer is really like. Uh, you're gonna have a water Pokemon, aren't you? You are challenged by Pokemon Trainer May. Pokemon Trainer May sent out Mudkip. You do have the water Pokemon because you're an evil bitch. Go torch it! Fire's not gonna be all that. Scratch! Scratch its eyes out! Ow. Oh, if that damn thing uses any kind of water move on me, I'm done. I'm toast. And it seems to be faster than my torture. Damn. Come on, Scratch. Yeah! No, no tackle. Please, please don't. I'm gonna have to give that Pokemon Center. Oh god. No, scratch its eyes out, Torchic! Uh, yes! Kicked your ass, mate. And now I'm level 7. Awesome. Oh, this is going to be such a grindy game. Defeated Pokemon Trainer May. Wow, that's great, Jay. You're pretty good. And I've received $200 or Poke Dollars for that. It was a good battle. Thanks. Let me heal up both our parties real quick. <clears throat> Not much of a party. It's like one Pokemon. Your team's health is restored. Wow. I think I know why my dad has his eye on me now. I mean, you just got that Pokemon, and you've already got that strong of a bond. I bet you could probably befriend any kind of Pokemon you meet. Phew. I guess I'd better head back to the lab. But, I... Uh, I... Uh, you kick my- you try to kick my Pokemon's ass and you just run away? Fine. Let's go back to the damn lab. Ow. I should just be able to go- Oh god. Jay! Over here! Let's hurry back to Little Root. What the hell you think I was doing? <laughs> I don't know why you just can't step over that, but hey, this is the lab, right? Yep. And away. Oh, Jay, over here! Okay. So I hear you beat May on your first try. That's amazing. May's been helping with my research for a long time, so she has a pretty long history as a trainer already. Mm hmm. I think that settles it. Jay, I ordered this Pokédex for my research, but I think you should take it. Thanks, man! The Pokédex is a high-tech tool that automatically makes a record of any Pokémon you meet or catch. My girl May takes hers with her everywhere she goes. Whenever she catches a rare Pokémon and records its data in the Pokédex, why she comes to seek me. Seek me out whenever I am in the field and show me. The Pokemon and people you will meet, and the great expanse of nature that lies before you. Experience in them both while you fill in your Pokedex. I'd love it if your world seemed wider than ever. Though I'd love it even more if you came back from time to time to show me what progress you've made. Erg, I'm getting the itch to get out and do field work again. Oh wow, Jay, now you've got a Pokédex too. That's great, just like me. Then here, I'll give you something too. Some Pokéballs that you could use to catch a wild Pokémon. Pokéballs! Jay put the Pokéballs in the item's pocket. If you catch a Pokemon in a wild and battle together with it for a while, it will grow stronger for you. 
Take that as a bit of advice from a more experienced trainer like me. But I just kicked your ass. I'm going to get ready to head out from Little Root soon myself. I can't wait to see what kind of Pokemon I'm going to meet. Let's both do our best on our journeys, Jay. Well then, um... The Pokemon are people you will meet, and the great expanse of nature... Uh, I, 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 you already said that! Shh. Go away! Shh. Okay, do your field work. Probably gotta go see my mom. Or can I just run out? But there you go. Jay, wait! Yeah, there we go. Jay, Jay! Did you introduce yourself to Professor Birch? Oh, what an adorable Pokemon. You got it from the Professor? How nice! You are your father's child, alright. You look good together with the Pokemon. To think that you have your very own Pokemon now. Your father will be overjoyed. But don't push yourself too hard. If anything happens, you can always come home, honey. Ah. Thanks, Mom! And we're going to... I don't know. I guess start our Pokemon journey in the next episode because we're almost at a half hour in this one and I just wanted to get the beginning out of the way for now. So this is, I think this is going to be a fun playthrough and I know the game's going to be quite grindy and I'll probably be doing all that grinding stuff to level up my Pokemon off screen. But you'll see all the important battles, like the gym battles, the rival battles, um, and you know whatever enemies we're gonna have, uh, Team Rocket Esker, whatever they're called in this game. You'll see all of that on screen. But I will be, uh, like I said, I will be grinding the Pokemon to level them up out in the field, off cam, because that's just boring stuff. But I do hope you guys <clears throat> enjoy this playthrough because I'm going to. I do love Pokemon and I really want to get back into it. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it for me guys. If you like this video then please hit that like button and if you haven't subscribed yet please do so now. And uh, thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. I sit alone.